What's happening, guys? Welfare bear here. We're gonna be dipping on some good stuff today. It's my main dip. Here's the premium. Creamy fucking yum. Winter green. If you don't dip that, you can eat a cop. I mean, for real. It's fucking, they got the premium in it for a reason. It's the best around. I mean, you don't want to be dipping skull pussy shit, you know. Exactly. Or, I mean. See, skull's got too many varieties, man. I mean, what's, what's next? Skull asparagus? I mean, for real. Grizzly, you stick to your main shit. But I did go into the store the other day. I was gonna try me another. I was gonna get back into the dipping straight. So I went into the store the other day. I asked them for Grizzly Gay. They didn't have it. It's like the only thing they said they had was Grizzly Straight. I was like, well, you prejudiced fuckers. I'm not gonna buy dip from here. So I ended up getting me another can of wintergreen. Been trying to quit, kill my jaw. But what can you do? Like, I actually have a fucking indention in my fucking jaw where this shit has fucking burned through my fucking jaw. I wouldn't recommend dipping if you're watching this. But if but you already dip, fuck it, dude. Just well, fuck it. Exactly. I mean. Also, my wisdom teeth are about to get cut out. So, been dipping. I've been doing some ore gel, right? This shit right here, make you feel a tent. Shit. Sick as tits. Sick as tits. Mm, god damn. Alright, so. That's some good shit. I numbed my mouth today, just for the hell of it, and I was fucking numb for maybe like 30 seconds. Shit's fucking good. Well, the mud jug of the day. Coke. Because I ain't got a fucking mud jug. I had a mud jug at one time, got stolen. So, I decided, why waste another $20 when it's going to get stolen again? By stolen, um, his his mom found it, so she took it. That bitch stole my mud jug. Yeah, she Let's, stole it. That. She stole it. She stole that shit. Alright, <laughs> fuck her. She don't want me dipping, but look what I'm doing. Made a dip video for all you son of bitches out there. Alright, so let's throw on a hammer. Well, let's... How do we want to do this? I'm going to put a dip in. Hey, you go ahead and put a dip in. Hey. Well, what if we got first time dippers out here? Let's show them how to throw in a hammer. No, dude. We don't pack our can. I'm not packing my can. We don't pack our can. Just makes us look like badasses. You ain't got to pack yours. I'm going to pack mine. Alright. Any of y'all there that's still pack on the top? That's all fine and dandy. I used to do it. But then I realized in school, you pack on the top, it's a lot of noise. Pack on the side, ain't nearly as much. You're sitting in class, you got the teacher across the room from you, and you're in the very corner. Pretend like you dropped your pencil, get out of your desk, sit down, hit it one good time, throw a hammer in, you're good to go. Make sure you always have your McDonald's sweet tea cup for your spitter at school. Anything else, no good, dude. Unless you got a five-hour energy, stuff that bitch with paper towels. Just fill it all the way up to the top with paper towels. So if you're sitting there spitting in it, and your teacher's like, what are you doing? Saying, I just finished up my drink. You can tip it upside down, nothing comes out. Go over there, throw it away, take out your dip point yet. Don't be fucking stupid. Had a dude last year, brought a pill bottle to school, stuffed with paper towels, was spitting in it. He got in trouble because he brought the pill bottle, not because he was dipping. Don't be stupid. Don't spit in clear bottles. Arizona tea, root beer, the old style root beer, McDonald's sweet tea, that's your three main shit. Don't be dumb. Yeah. You, if Don't be stupid. If your school's got cans, it's the best one. All right, well, I'm gonna throw in a hammer. Eh. 
And um, would it would it kill you guys to subscribe to this? At least, I mean, it's just a little button so sus subscribe, and uh, we'd really appreciate it. So, while you're at it, if you want to see me about five years ago, go on YouTube to your search bar, type in Skull Man. And uh, it should be the first one. Uh, I think our channel name was The Tobacco League. I was about 12 years old whenever we made that video. And I was dipping Skull at the time. I never do that shit again. I had like really had just started. But I had some good times. Let's just say mistakes bring me to where I am today. So doing the mistake by dipping skull brought me to dipping grizzly the welfare bear also have y'all guys ever seen the grizzly claws what you do is where the hell my pet go? oh here it is if you ever have a grizzly claw what it is is it's a bear claw and it's like the fingers are curled around to where you have the fingernails it has a little bitty ball on it to where you put in this indention ball right here right here in the middle of your can. You turn your can upside down or you can keep it like this. It doesn't really matter. I prefer upside down. If you put it on, the only thing you do is just spin your can. So if you just got done biting your fingernails or something and you can't bite and you can't crack your can, that grizzly claw will help you. It'll save your life. Um, also, if you haven't checked out um, Outlaw Dipper yet, you need to do that. Um, this shit's funny. If you comment on any of his videos or anything, this shit's funny, dude. Say, um, like right now, I think out in uh, Oklahoma, they have uh, Copenhagen Mint. I I was watching his video yesterday and about Copenhagen Mint. Usually, if you send him a private message, like if you get his phone number or whatever, um, through YouTube and you text him and ask him to send you some dip, the only thing he requires is you do a review on it and uh, make sure you give him a shout out. But go over there and like his um, channel, Outlaw Dipper, and um, live the thrill TV. Um, he got a new one because he's doing this like Outlaws Outhouse thing where he's answering all y'all's questions on uh, Twitter and Facebook. And um, so if y'all got a question for him, y'all want to be featured in a video, shout out, whatever, go like him on Facebook, go like him on Twitter. And uh, you'll have a chance to be shout out. But like I said, go uh, go subscribe to Outlaw Dipper and uh, Live the Thrill TV. Alright guys, we out. Keep the lips packing.